Hello, my name is Eddie Spear. Um, yeah! I'm running for Congress in the uh, 16th District against Vern Buchanan. Yay! And I'm going to start by saying what we need to do, what I'm going to ask you to do is join the revolution. Join the revolution against tyranny. It's still going on and we still need soldiers against this tyranny that's looking to steal all of our freedoms and our liberties that our forefathers fought so hard for. We're giving them away. But it's a spiritual battle. Please understand that it's a spiritual battle. The enemy of our souls is masquerading as an angel of light. They're Democrats, they're totalitarians that are masquerading as, as Republicans. And we need to call them out for what they are. And that's what I've done and that's what I'll continue, continue to do. I started off by uh, being a trustee at New College of Florida. And at New College of Florida, the first thing I did is I called for prayer and the Pledge of Allegiance. I was immediately met with a death threat. That's when I knew that this is a spiritual battle. Then what we did, we called for the elimination of DEI. And we were the first university in the nation to get rid of DEI. Now everybody else is getting rid of DEI. It starts spiritually first. Please understand that. Then I didn't stop there. Thank you for the pause, but I'm not stopping there. We went further and said we got to get rid of gender studies. Because gender studies is where the trans agenda is being normalized for all of our youth. They are trying to destroy our youth this way. And, it's, and we were the first university in the nation to get rid of gender studies. It starts spiritually. And now I'm running against Vern Buchanan, who has voted for the Green New Deal, believe it or not, as a Republican. He has voted for the FBI to spy on American citizens. He has voted for $5.5 trillion. He spends more than the average Democrat. These are not Republican values. This is not the Republican platform. This is somebody that's masquerading as a Republican and needs to be called out. And it's also a spiritual battle. So I ask you to join the revolution. And what I can ask you specifically to do is simply pray. Now I'm not, I'm not saying that this is, this is this combination of everything. Please pray. Pray for this country, pray for our families, and pray for this district and this county. Thank you very much.